Hello everyone, I have some exciting news to share with everyone today. Google's most advanced AI, Gemini, now supports iPhone and real-time interactive conversations. It feels like just like engaging in a face-to-face -face dialogue with a real person, with almost no delay in its real-time conversation feedback, making it incredibly responsive. It's fantastic for simultaneous translation or for practicing foreign language speaking. If you have kids learning a foreign language at home. It's like having a free language tutor. In previous video, I shared how to use ChatGPT's real-time conversation feature for mock interviews or as a simultaneous translator. However, ChatGPT has usage limits, and after the free conversation time is used up, you need to subscribe to continue using it. But Gemini's real-time interactive conversation are completely free for now, and you can use it as much as you like. Moreover, Gemini is now fully compatible with iPhone devices. Today, I will show you how to use Gemini's real-time conversation feature on both iPhone and Android phones. OK, let's take a look at my phone now. Let's go. OK, welcome to my phone. So you can see I have three phones, and this one is iPhone. That one is also iPhone. This one is iOS. I'm running iOS 18, and this one is running iOS 16. And this is your Android phone. So all those three phones are already installed the uh, Gemini. You can see the Gemini and the Gemini. For the iPhone, the Gemini is from the App Store. You just search for the Gemini, and you can will find the uh, Google Gemini and to install it uh, on your iPhone for, for both the iOS 8, 8, 16 and, uh, and iOS 18. For the Android phone, you also can find it from the Play Store, Google Play Store, to install the Gemini. OK, so let's show this, uh, this uh, upgrade for the Gemini. Now it supports the iPhone. Let's go and check to get the Gemini. And you will see that I already activated the live chat. Yes, the live chat. I will show you later how to activate the live chat if you didn't, if you didn't see this uh, live chat button. Now I'll show you why, how it is different with uh, like like this one uh, microphone. This one, we, which means um, sentence by sentence chat chat with the uh, uh, the uh, Gemini. But this live chat, you just uh, communicate like face to face with a real person. If you have if you ha have kids or you are learning foreign language, I think this uh, live chat is very good to practice your um, your foreign language and to use it as your interpreter one by one. I will show you the uh, effect. Okay, I click this button live chat. Please be my real-time translator. I say English, you translate it into Japanese. No other words. This is a dog. That is a cat. Okay, now I will cancel this uh, discussion. Okay, I will next I will show you how to activate this uh, live chat if you can't see that. First, we, for the iPhone, uh, we just go to iPhone iOS 18. We just go to the settings and uh, go to the uh, menus and uh, scroll down, you will see apps. Apps here, I mean the, the settings and scroll down to the apps here. Yeah, apps and click the Gemini, find the Gemini G. Uh, which means uh, start from G. Yeah, Gemini. Go to Gemini, and uh, you need to select the language here. The language selected as uh, the uh, English as uh, your primary language. If you choose your other language, you can't see this uh, live chat for the uh, uh, iPhone. And here, and go to the Gemini again, and then we'll, we you will see this one. This is the live chat button. Okay, and for the iOS uh, 16, also we go to the settings and uh, go to drop down scroll down and you will see this uh, Gemini here just uh, directly from the uh, scroll down to the bottom and you will see the Gemini also you will go to the language and choose your primary language as English yes and then you will see the Gemini here but uh, I mean if you still can't see this live chat button uh, here and uh, another setting is go to the uh, uh, button here click this uh, your icon button here and uh, go to manage your Google account. Click the manage your Google account and uh, go to your personal information. And uh, go to your personal information here. Click personal information and uh, scroll down. Here you will see scroll down and uh, the language. We just uh, change the language here. Click the language and edit the uh, primary language. Here you can see preferred language and click this uh, pencil here. Click this pencil and uh, you just uh, 
key in the uh, like in English. We just key in English. Yeah, select English, and uh, select uh, the uh, country like Australia or United Came or United States. We just find the United States. You can see the United States. Click this United States and click Save. Just choose uh, your preferred language as the uh, English and the United States, and go back and go back and. Uh, Close the uh, Gemini key, uh, key, key and uh, reopen it. Or you need to wait for several hours. Then uh, several hours later, you will see the uh, live chat button uh, appear here. And after that, I just suggest you just uh, switch on the, uh, the extensions here. Click the uh, icon button and extensions to make the uh, Gemini connected with your Google's other uh, applications like uh, Google Flight, Google Hotel, and Google Maps. Google Workspace and uh, YouTube and YouTube Music. Uh, connect with these uh, services and you can play the music um, in the Gemini. It's very easy to use it. Let's go to like, uh, I click this microphone and click Allow. Play some music. So you can see because I already installed sure, the YouTube music, music and it can automatically open your YouTube music to play the YouTube music. It's very easy to use it. So that's a Gemini uh, because it connected with your uh, uh, other Google services like Google Music and uh, check your Gmail. Yeah, let's have a look. Check your Gmail. Check my Gmail. And you can see it will connect with your G Google Gmail account and see if you have a new uh, email coming in and it will give you some summarize of your Google Gmail. Yeah. It's very easy I found to use. emails in your Gmail. Security alerts from Google. Yeah, you can find the uh, yeah you can find the useful functions here. Okay, and for the Android settings uh, to this live chat, let's go to the Android settings. And uh, and here you can see you can see this live chat here. And if you can't see this one, the same settings like manage your Google account to set your language primary language as English. And uh, for the uh, Android, you can go to the settings and go to here, the language, yeah, it's a, it has a language, and go to the language settings, go to English, and you can select the English, United States, as your primary language, yeah, English, United States, and this one, you can add your secondary language, you can choose like uh, Japanese or other language as your secondary language, so it can uh, make the uh, Gemini as a bilingual uh, Gemini can understand your local language and your English speaking language. So after that, you will see this button and you can kill this uh, Gemini and reopen this Gemini again. Then you will see this live chat here and, and you can communicate with the, with the Gemini. For example, I click it. Let's do a mock interview. You will be the interviewer. I will be the interviewee. I apply for the uh, teacher's job as an English teacher. All right, let's do this. Welcome to the interview. I'll be playing the role of the principal, and you're here to discuss the English teacher position. Let's start with the basics. Can you tell me a little about your background and experience? Yes, I have uh, uh, experience as an English teacher, so I think this job is very uh, suitable for me to uh, do an English teacher. That's great to hear. Can you give me some specific examples of your experience? Yeah, so uh, if you have kids, you know, your kids can uh, mock the uh, interview or practice he, uh, his uh, language, foreign language, with his tutor, language tutor. It's free of charge, not just as a chat GPT. It need, you need to subscribe, otherwise you can't use it, uh, use its limits. So for currently, I mean, the Gemini has no usage limit. You can use it anytime and without a limitation of the usage. Okay, if you like my sharing, don't forget to thumb up and see you next time. Bye-bye.